Hi, my name is James. I'm a mechanical engineer and academic research scientist in Ontario, Canada. I took fluoxetine um, under the brand name Prozac from August to November 31st of 2015. Um, prescribed to me by my family doctor to help me with uh, sleep trouble during a relatively stressful period of my master's degree. Um, by November 31st, I had noticed I had developed a significant tremor in my left hand. don't know if you can see that. Uh, at which point I took it to my doctor and he promptly told me um, that, that that was a possible side effect of the medication and to stop uh, immediately uh, such that the issue would clear up. Uh, within six weeks, of stopping the drug, uh, not only did I notice that my uh, tremor in my left hand did not go away, but I, um, six weeks later, had developed very obvious and potent um, sexual dysfunction in the form of absence of any form of libido, uh, as well as erectile dysfunction, um, watery, inviscid semen for the first time in my entire life, um, um, yeah, all of a sudden, as if a switch was flipped approximately six weeks after starting the drug, uh, all of those effects um, were quite noticeable in, in an instant. Uh, over the course of the last five years, uh, in response to these issues, I've seen two neurologists, two urologists, two psychiatrists, and of course my family doctor. Uh, none of them have shed any light on these issues. None of them have offered any uh, ability to resolve them or expressed uh, particular interest in doing so. Both urologists that I did see about the problem uh, did express knowledge about it, and they both told me uh, that I had so-called post-SSRI sexual dysfunction, or PSSD, uh, although they did not link that directly to the tremor or discuss any form of mechanism by which any of that would have happened. So five years later, um, neither the sexual issues nor the tremor um, has improved whatsoever on, on its own, certainly. Uh, I've done certain things uh, in terms of lifestyle, diet, exercise uh, that have helped somewhat with with uh, both the tremor as well as the sexual symptoms at various times in the last five years. Um, but beyond that, there's been no sign of, of any form of natural uh, healing process occurring, and, and there's very much before and after uh, timeline uh, in my own biochemistry very clearly um, since before and after taking those drugs. So to anyone else out there, uh, suffering from post-SSRI sexual dysfunction, PSSD, or any other kind of uh, enduring side effects after taking antidepressant drugs. Um, there is much that can be done. I'm saying that as both one of you and as an academic scientist myself. Um, there is much that can be done that is absolutely not being done at this point and will not be done so long as we are all suffering in silence. So please submit your story, uh, make a video just like this one, and send it to sexdrugsandrockandroll.pssd at gmail.com. And let's get the word out together. And let's give government uh, in our respective countries, as well as academic scientists like myself, but in the biomedical domain, uh, the awareness and the tools that they need um, to start solving this problem with us. And let's get to the finish line together. Uh, you're never alone in this. Uh, so let's get to it together. Mm -hmm.